amazing testimonies. My name is Tumi Asada. I'm coming from Douala. I've, I've come here this morning to give to testify the goodness of God or the healings over my life. I had a problem, of an abscess. I went to the hospital, I had a back pain. I had a, an, an abscess, very big. Uh, there was no way, you could not see any opening or about the abscess because they gave me an injection. Okay, the abscess resulted from the injection they gave you at the hospital? Yes. Uh, immediately after the injection, the, 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 the place just was just going very big. I was not doing everything. I was just lying. For more than two months, I was just lying on the bed. They were doing, taking care of me, doing everything. I was unable to eat. I was unable to stand. The place was very heavy because there was no opening to start. They were talking about operation. So I refused. Even my neighbors, one of the, the landlady told me that it's better for me to go and die in my village rather than to stay here. I stayed there. One uh, uh, neighbor that is fellowshipping here, she came to me that evening. Or it was a Sunday evening. She came back to church and rushed to me. She prayed with me with the anointing oil and just applied it there. I took it, I rubbed it all over my body, I drank it, and I almost finished the bottle. I drank it, I rubbed it. The next day, the month, that was my, for more than two months, that was my first time to sleep. I slept that day until the next morning, when my auntie got up, there was already an opening. There was already a whitish portion that they could force it to come out. In the evening, that same day, it started posing out. That was something they were telling me that they could only do an operation. The next testimony is that yet I, I, I have not yet visited this place. The ne- I'm, still, I'm still on a sick bed. I finished the anointing water they, they gave me. I was, still having, I was still seriously sick because I lied down for five, more than five months. So um, one day I was lying in my bed. My daughter was crying. She wants to eat, but I was unable to raise my hand to do anything. So the cameraman here is my neighbor. I just said, they are anglophones speaking. They just go there. They are always praying there. Go and tell that woman that I should give you bread, anything for you to eat. She came back. He came. The woman followed me and came. She followed the child and came and told me, and met me in the house. I was lying desperately. I could not walk. I could not do anything. She went and took the anointing oil. I've been having itches from uh, vagina itches for more than 15 years. Seriously, when at, it is at, 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 in that process, I'm always masturbating. I'll masturbate until I will release. When this thing is doing me, I'm all crying because I said, This is not normal. I've been going from place to place, but there's no solution for that. And that very evening, as she gave me the anointing oil, I drank it. When around 8 o'clock, I was about to sleep, I usually apply it in my private part. Not up to around 1 o'clock. I dreamt that a crap, a very big crap, came out from my private part. And the next day, I could not fear anything because I was the, the, the thing always gives me wound. That was all about the, 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 the itches. I never fear anything, nothing, nothing. Something I've been doing. Okay, so it's how long now that you receive this miraculous healing? It's like three months. Hallelujah. So it's three months today that she has been completely set free from all these problems. And what can we say to the viewers, especially about the anointing oil? It is wonderful. That's what I was saying that I, I was using the anointing oil when I've not yet been coming here. I sent it to one of my sisters in the village. Something just, just, I, I just and in a moment like this, she was just sitting, something just came out from with his face like pimples all over her face. He had been using many things. I just sent the anointing oil. Immediately the very day, he, she applied everything was just clear and she was free. So I just want to I just want to advise people, don't minimize what God has anointed for you people. Don't minimize it. You can say you have moved from where to where but you don't know. Don't minimize something that is anointed from the man of God because it's the grace of God and patient, patient and prayers. C'est Madame Tommy Asana qui vient de Douala. Elle, elle dit dans son témoignage qu'après une injection, 
parce qu'elle était un jour allée à l'hôpital parce qu'elle avait une douleur au niveau de son dos, de, ses, de sa hanche. Alors quand elle est arrivée, on l'a injectée et après cette injection, ça, ça a eu, euh, causé un abcès et elle a souffert de cet abcès pendant deux mois au point où elle était seulement couchée, elle ne pouvait rien faire d'elle-même. Alors il y a une soeur qui est ici, bien qu'elle ne percevait pas ici, qui lui a donné une nuit d'onction qu'elle a appliqué sur l'abcès et depuis deux mois, elle n'arrivait pas à dormir. Après avoir appliqué cette idée là sur elle, elle a commencé à dormir et directement, il y a eu une ouverture pour que l'abcès soit percé. Deuxièmement, elle témoigne, elle dit que depuis 15 ans, elle souffrait d'une des démangeaisons vaginales très graves et cela la causait à se masturber tout le temps et elle s'était dit déjà en elle-même que ce n'était pas un truc ordinaire parce qu'elle est allée partout pour la solution, mais en vain. Alors, il y a l'épouse d'un de nos frères de l'église qui lui a donné une édition, qu'elle appliquait sur elle, elle buvait, et elle appliquait sur sa partie privée. Et un jour, quand elle dormait, elle arrivait qu'un crabe elle est sorti de sa partie privée. Et c'est comme ça que depuis trois mois aujourd'hui, elle a été libérée de tous ses problèmes au nom de Jésus. Liberty TV, bringing God's presence into your home. Liberty TV. La présence de Dieu chez vous.